In recent times, Apple has been doubling down on its efforts in India. Now, the iPhone XR received a massive price cut a few months ago, and with the launch of the iPhone 11 series, the XR's price has been cut further. Now, the iPhone 11 also has been reasonably priced when you compare it with other flagships in the market. Now, the next step to this is software. iOS 13 is out here right now, and you also see a whole bunch of India-specific features in iOS 13. Now, these are not just surface-level features, there's actually deep system-level features that have been added just for India. Now, we found the best of these India-specific features and highlighted them for you in this video. Before watching this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so that you're notified when we publish new videos. With iOS 13, Siri now has a new voice and it's Indian English. I'm Siri, your virtual assistant. This is available in the standard male and female versions, so you could pick whichever you like. Here's the forecast for today. This is the only new Siri voice in iOS 13 and the others which were present in iOS 12 are American, Australian, British, Irish and South African. You can change this via settings, Siri and search, Siri voice. India is a country where Wi-Fi penetration is low and mobile data is really cheap and also easily accessible. So earlier, iOS had a limit of 100 MB for apps that you could download on mobile data. That was recently raised to 200 MB and now that limit is not there anymore. Go to Settings, iTunes and App Stores, App Downloads and then select Always Allow. Now, iOS has had the Hindi keyboard, which lets you type in the Devanagari script for a while, but it did not have typing predictions. So when you're typing, it did not suggest new words or the next word that you could type. Now, this has been added with iOS 13. Go to Settings, General, Keyboard, Keyboards and tap Add New Keyboard. Now select Hindi and then Devanagari. Now, whenever you type in Hindi, you will see suggested predictions. In our limited experience so far, the predictions have proved to be pretty good. The English keyboard on iOS 12 has been replaced with Hindi Latin on iOS 13. If you feel like typing Hindi messages in the Roman, which is English script, this keyboard is perfect for you. The bilingual Hindi Latin keyboard has typing predictions, which makes it a lot easier to type. You can enable it by going to settings, general, keyboard, keyboards and tapping the add new keyboard button. Now you can select Hindi Latin. The Hindi Latin keyboard is different from the transliteration keyboard. So what the transliteration keyboard does is it allows you to type in English characters and converts it to Devanagari script. Whereas the Hindi Latin keyboard will let you type in English characters and it will keep it in English script only, but it will be Hindi language. So it's a bilingual keyboard. Now this is more useful instead of the English keyboard because the auto suggest, the auto prediction that is there for characters, that will be slightly different. Like it won't suggest English words, it will suggest Hindi words which are written in the Roman script. I know it's a little confusing, but just use the Hindi Latin keyboard if you want to type in Hindi, but keep the English script and the transliteration keyboard if you want to use the Devanagari script, but you're more comfortable with the English script keyboard. iOS 13 has 15 new Indian language keyboards and Apple says that it now supports all 22 official languages of India on iOS. The new ones include Assamese, Bodo, Dogri, Kashmiri, Konkani, Manipuri, Maithili, Nepali, Sanskrit, Santali, and Sindhi. You can check these out by heading to Settings, General, Keyboard, Keyboards, and tapping Add New Keyboard. By now, it's clear that a lot of iOS 13 features are to do with languages, and there's one more that's been added just now. So in iOS 13, when you set up a new device on iOS 13 or when you're updating your old device to iOS 13, you will see a new prompt. If iOS detects that you are using multiple languages, then it'll let you quickly add these right during the setup process. iOS 13 has added some new fonts for Indian languages as well. So there are four new system language fonts and up to 30 new document fonts. So if you open a bunch of documents on your device that are in Indian languages, you will see the benefit. 
There's another nifty little feature in iOS 13 that's very useful for India, but it depends on third-party developers implementing it. Now, Apple says that with iOS 13, apps such as Netflix and Hotstar can download content depending on the time of the day when the peak traffic, peak cellular data traffic is less. So if the network is congested, it takes more time to download shows and movies. Now, according to Apple, these apps can optimize for that. So that was our quick roundup of the best India specific or features targeted at India in iOS 13. Which one of these is your favorite? Which other India specific feature have you spotted in iOS 13? Let us know these things via the comments. And for all things tech, don't forget to log on to gadgets360.com.